And now we're talking to Pam Fletcher, who is in charge of the electrification of uh, Chevrolet cars. And uh, we just uh, hear like the presentation here today. And uh, a lot of people talk about other companies like Tesla, like it's like the electric car, but like there's a lot going on in Chevrolet, like completely overdo that. I mean, like, it's like much more, right? Absolutely right, Javier. You know, Chevrolet has an amazing electrified showroom today, and it's only getting better. You know, we took you today through um, three vehicles, three electrified vehicles, um, three technologies to meet different customers' uh, needs that are coming to the Chevrolet showroom, you know, in the just months ahead of us. So the, the, the first example of that was the Bolt that debuted in uh, 2011, uh, is that correct? The Chevrolet, the second generation Chevrolet Volt, uh, which debuted in, um, actually in uh 2010, 2010 is now coming out in its second generation, and it'll be here. It'll be out in the marketplace uh, shortly, just early in the second half of 2015. So, what are the improvements for the second generation uh, of the Volt? Yeah, the second generation Volt has a more than 30% increase in electric range, so 50 miles. So, we think about more than 90% of the time a driver gets behind the wheel of a Volt, it will be an all electric driving experience. And that was the main uh, thing that consumers were asking for, like more range, I guess, is like the main thing that people want in an electric car, right? Yeah, they love electric driving, so more range was about the first 10 items on their wish list. And uh, some of the examples that, I mean, you, you already have obviously, what, three years of, uh, more than, almost five years of uh, selling the, the Bolt, and what are the feedback that you're getting, aside from like the, the demand for more range? I mean, people are people love yeah. the, the electric range, as you said. But like the they love other the electric things. range. They just find the car fun to drive, and I think it's from many aspects. One is that quick acceleration you get with the electric motors. I think it's from the smoothness. You know, there's no shifting like you get in transmissions. I think it's the quietness. I think the whole experience is just something they really appreciate. On top of not having to put any gasoline in the car. Yeah, that, that must be one of the of the main things, right? Because I. With the electric cars, you really have to learn a little bit how to use it and then to get most out of it. And not going to the gas station is, is like one of the, of the main things. And you were saying, like, the, the original got a, a range of, what, 37 officially? Or what was? Yep, when we launched the car at 35, we 35. improved that to 38 over the, uh, the course of its life. And most people uh, that you study, I mean, some of the customers are already getting even more of that, right? And it's like a, the, the result of learning how to drive an electric car, Can, is that fair to say? Uh, two things. I think one is just uh, with our battery pack and the way we manage our, our energy, customers are able to experience the range on the label and a lot of times even more. We just surveyed customers that had owned their car for more than three years um, in California and they were all experiencing um, the same range that was on their label when they bought it. So we're so really that, proud of that. So those fears of the battery getting weaker or like not recharging fully and all that, I mean, that's gone. I mean, you have you yeah. have facts to prove it. We have data that says uh, customers can count on their battery to be a reliable you know, source of energy for their car. So the new generation of the Bolt is already out on the market or when is it coming uh, out? Soon. Early in the second half of this year. So okay. we're right on the cusp of it uh, being in the market. So then the other example is the Malibu Hybrid, mm -hmm. which is a completely different technology. All Always an electrification part of it, but it's like an amazing technology for a completely different car, right? Different use. Yeah, you're exactly right, Javier. You know, uh, we have many uh, customers, owners that love a nice mid-sized car. They want that uh, space for their family. They want the truck space, trunk space to haul the yeah. things their family needs. But they also want, you know, efficiency. They want um, good fuel economy. And I think this new Malibu hybrid package is really going to be loved by a lot of people. So where is the battery pack uh, in the Malibu place? Because some of the hybrid, that segment, lose a lot of trunk space yep. for that. No problem in this car. Um, it's uh, largely at the back seat. So the trunk space is still um, everything that 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 mid-sized car sedan oh, customer expects. And what are the, what are the numbers, the figure for uh, efficiency in that car? What do you get? The fuel economy, 47 miles per gallon wow, combined in car. the U.S., yes. And amazing. So the third car that we talked today about is the new Bolt mm -hmm. with a B, like in boy. Bolt EV. <laughs> exactly, Bolt EV. So this is like a completely new car that you show in Detroit for the first time. We're like looking at it here now, it's radio. So uh, can you t tell us about what, what's in this car, please? Yeah, Bolt EV is going to be a game changer. It's going to make electrification, electric driving 
um, available to all. 200 miles at about $30,000 uh, U.S. So we think it's going to give people um, not only a beautiful car, but with the space that they need, passengers and cargo, um, at a price they can afford. So a couple of things. Uh, this is a prototype. This is the prototype, or this is this close is to production. Is, is it a concept? This is a concept car. Still. But you saw earlier today yeah. we showed you the video of the real car in test. Yeah, which is already being uh, built for testing. Yes. Right. Okay. The other thing is that what allows, uh, what technology allows you to to get like that range, 200 miles? And it's just the battery. It's like yeah. the, what? What is it? It's everything. So uh, Josh Tavel, our chief engineer, took you through all the details you have to pay attention to to make every part of the car efficient because everything contributes to increasing the range of the car. And uh, we don't have dates for this to to go in and sell yet. Uh, we're not ready to release those okay. dates. But uh, it was show in Detroit again uh, in uh, this year, right? Uh, we're, I'm not making any additional announcements about okay. our plans for the. Car. No, I mean the prototype was showing. It Detroit. was shown this past year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay. Well, thank you very much for your time and, and information. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.